Okay, today we are talking about a shaft straightening device. So what is a shaft straightening device? Well, here is a shaft straightening device that I designed. It's basically made of an arbor press for the main body. So you clamp your shaft in these V-blocks. And when you move the ram down on an area of your shaft that is bent, it will straighten it. Woo! So whether you're talking about a camshaft uh, maybe a, a shaft inside of a motor or a pump, etc. And you would use a dial indicator to check the runout all across the length of the shaft to see where exactly on the shaft you need to make an adjustment. You can see the arbor press is bolted to this base plate. This half inch base plate made of steel is bolted to your workbench. And there's room to get your hand up underneath there to adjust the location of the V-blocks using T-nuts to secure the V-blocks to the slotted plate. Here is an AutoCAD drawing I did of a Arbor Press shaft straightening device that I designed and built. Again, if you make a shaft straightening device for your facility, make sure you buy an Arbor Press that is tall enough to accommodate the height of your V-blocks, the diameter of your shaft that you need to straighten. Uh, also take into account the attachments that you're going to attach to the ram on your arbor press. You can also get different height V-blocks as well. Woo! It's crucial to make sure the slotted plate is surface ground that slotted plate has to be surface ground to be as flat and smooth as possible, otherwise you may get false readings on your dial indicator. And you make a wrong adjustment to your shaft when it may not need an adjustment. <gasps> so again, it is vital that that slotted plate that you see here is surface ground across its entirety. And it would be a best practice to make sure the bottom of your V-blocks is also surface ground and keep it perfectly clean. Don't allow dust and dirt on there because again, that could affect your magnetic dial indicator from giving you an accurate reading when you're trying to adjust a shaft. And you see, we or I designed and fabricated these aluminum attachments for the ram on the arbor press because that aluminum is softer than the steel shafts that we need to adjust so we eliminate damaging the shafts. And we went with thick three-quarter inch steel plate construction for this because we wanted to minimize any minor flexing in that plate when we're making our adjustments. I hope this information helps you. Please like, share, subscribe, leave me a comment, and thanks for watching.